All right. Hey, uh, first off, I want to say thank you to uh, everyone that came out this evening to support Rosa High School football. Also, we want to say thank you, big thank you to the Lincoln Tigers. And uh, they came out this evening with the victory. Um, I don't know, it was like 20, 22 14, maybe something like that. Um, it was a great game, great game. And I want to say thank you to Coach Cotero. And uh, he does a great job over at Lincoln High School with the Lincoln High School football program. Um, and those fans, man, those fans came out and they were, you could, I could hear them on this side of the, of the sideline, and that was pretty cool. Uh, our fans were here and they were, of course, um, you know, in the house and, and they were going nuts. Our band was going cool, it was great, and the, uh, the cheerleaders were out there. And it was cool, it was just a great experience. Unfortunately, it didn't end the way we thought. Uh, we made just, you know, too many mistakes. We, at the end of the day, we made too many mistakes. And you can't make that many mistakes against a good program. So, um, Coach Otero and, and those and the Tigers, I'm sure they're gonna they're gonna have a um, they'll, they'll wind up, you know, doing really well. And maybe you know, Roosevelt sees them in the playoffs, and 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 that'll be a fun rematch. But it's been years. It's been years since uh, Lincoln and Roosevelt have competed, uh, you know, at this level. And uh, you know, I just want to say thank you to you know Eastside. Um, media TV and dot TV and um, and Eric Sarney and you know it's just it's incredible Eric that you that you do this you know you do this every every weekend for many many years and we're so grateful so um, you know we got Crenshaw next week and hopefully you guys are able to come down uh, the game will not be on Friday but we have a holiday a school holiday on Friday so our game will be here Thursday at 7 p.m. so next week Thursday 7 p.m. We're not sure if we have a JV uh, matchup. We're going to be looking for a game for the JV team. Um, but, you know, hopefully you're here. It's a few bucks to get in. But more importantly, I think it's just cool to be out here in the stands and just, you know, having a little bit of normal. Having a little bit of normal and uh, just putting away your, you know, just kind of forget about COVID and all the crap that's surrounding us with, with, with this disease. And so hopefully you guys are are able to be here next Thursday, 7 p.m. We have uh, Crenshaw High School, actually. We have Crenshaw High School coming down and Coach Garrett, and he has his, I'm sure his, his boy is gonna be ready to go. And uh, this should be a very, very good game. So uh, thank you all. I wanna thank my, our administration, our principal, uh, Mr. Gertner of Rosewood High School, and of course his admin team. And, you know, definitely I need to thank Dave Perea. Uh, Dave Perea, our athletic director, and his assistant Maribor Grajales. Um, they are an incredible team and we are just so fortunate to have them. But uh, our staff did a great job today. Uh, and, and you know, we, we just we just got to prepare the boys a little bit better and, and, and fix those mistakes. So um, at the end of the day, I always tell people when, when we win, the kids did a great job. When we lose the coaching staff, especially me, you know, we made mistakes. I made mistakes. So I'll take this one but I'm very proud of the boys and their effort. And uh, that's pretty much it. So once again, thank you to Eric Sarney and Eastside Media TV. And we hope to see you next week, Thursday. Have a good one.